Hello everyone and welcome to Senior Olympic Gaming. If you're here for the first time, thank you for checking the channel out. And if you've been here before, welcome back. Today we are unboxing an awesome album by Jason Mraz. This is the 15th anniversary clear vinyl release for his 2008 album, We Sing, We Dance, We Steal Things. This album contains his most famous song, I'm Yours, which spent a then record 76 weeks on the Billboard Hot 100. It also has a couple of other famous songs that honestly I didn't know won Grammys, so not too shabby. So let's open this up and check it out. Uh, as always, I like to keep the sticker on the wrap if I can because I am a sticker fiend. I personally love this album because my first Jason Mraz concert was during this era. It was back in 2009 and it was the Cafe Gratitude Tour which is still to this day one of the best concerts I have ever been to. This is a cover of the album and we'll just uh, quickly compare it to the original 2008 release. As you can see, it's just some slight variations to the color and the artwork is practically the same. Uh, also, just to quickly show you the track list for this limited edition, you'll see most of these songs are what is on the extra content of the LP. So the material that they used for the sleeve very much feels like recycled cardboard. It's pretty thick, but it does feel like it's made out of recycled material, which feels very on brand for Jason, honestly. Now let's look at the track list for this album. Some of my favorites include Make It Mine, Butterfly, Live High, Details is an awesome duet, uh, Coyotes and Dynamo are great live songs, and also the last two songs are pretty amazing. As for the extra content, most of the songs have been released as parts of different EPs around the time of the album release. Most of them are actually on that limited edition CD that I showed you a while ago. There are also some demos for some of the really popular songs. And the song Kicking With You was on a soundtrack album. And the only real new song is Happy Endings. It's a really good song and honestly surprising that it got cut out of the original release. Opening up the trifold, there's some song credits and some more doodle portraits. And I have to say that I do love the art style of this album. It's very, I'll, I'll call it quirky with all of the random doodles. Kind of reminds me of all of my notebooks and textbooks back uh, in school. <laughs> uh, although one thing I don't like is the coarse cardboard makes it hard to pull the record sleeve out. Uh, the rough texture makes it sort of stick uh, and it's also pretty tricky to put the record back into the sleeve. But honestly, aside from that minor gripe, the packaging is really well made and sturdy. Um, inside we have a booklet with a few photographs of Jason, some handwritten lyrics, uh, an article talking about the history and inspiration behind the album, and a track-by-track -track description by Jason, which is a very interesting read. A uh, fun fact that I just learned myself, famous pop singer Rita Ora is in one of the songs as a background vocalist long before she was famous herself. So there you go. I always enjoy it when songwriters talk about the backstory behind their work. Uh, on the back, there's another track list and shows where the extra content originally appeared. Before we look at the vinyl itself, I'll tell you that I got this from the US Amazon website. It was on sale through there, but you can also purchase it from the official Jason Mraz store. And now let's finally look at what the actual vinyl looks like. And wow, it looks amazing. This is the clearest vinyl I have ever seen. Actually, it's very clean looking. Uh, the center art is consistent with the rest of the album, has the tracks written on the one side, and each disc has a unique portrait on it as well. And it's not even the same as the ones in the inner sleeve. They're all unique portraits. Just to show you what I mean, here is another one of the records. I won't show you the third one just because like uh, I said before, they are a little tough to excise from the packaging. But here you go. This is what the other disc looks like. 
And uh, finally, the most important part, why don't we take this for a spin and see what it sounds like. Uh, just to warn you though, I will be talking over the audio just so we don't run into any copyright issues with uh, music owners. And that is it for this unboxing of the Jason Raz We Sing, We Dance, We Steal Things 15th Anniversary Clear Vinyl. If you're a Mraz fan, I highly recommend grabbing one of these. The new song is great, the rare demos, uh, the articles in the booklet, they're well worth it. It's available on his website and also uh, at the time of my recording, it is on sale uh, on Amazon US. Guys, thank you so much for joining me in unboxing this LP. And if you enjoyed the video, please do hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I hope you guys have yourselves a wonderful day. See you soon. Cheers. Bye.